for KI. That's what that meant. Probably. Probably. Yeah, man. So we all we all come together for five. Basically. Might not all for like it, hatred. but you know. Yeah. So I'm interested to see. Wow. Really? No. Okay. It, I'm interested to see if yeah. Christy goes to Karen, or Christy sticks to Cammy, or if he goes to Nash. Yeah. Right now, it looks like he's going with Cammy. Uh, it's... Not sure how I feel about the matchups. <laughs> <laughs> I think it's okay oh, for both sides. You think so? Yeah. I don't know, man. I feel like I don't know shit about any of these characters. That's true. So I played. I haven't played very much. Right. And not especially against Cammy, but mm. I wasn't really frustrated or worried whenever I did play one. Okay. Yeah, I mean, right now, Paul B, he's definitely taking the early lead. This guy, he's not too well known in the Street Fighter scene. Ooh. I don't really think he played for it that much. Uh, but he's a really, really accomplished, uh, really skilled KI player. Mm. Uh, he's been tearing and it up now I think it's, five. I think it's fair to say that he's a Street Fighter 5 player. Yeah. Because He's been showing up consistently to win tonight fights, entering at five, and he's been doing better pretty much every week. You know, like mm -hmm. if he's if he doesn't make top 16 one week, uh, then he will the next. You know, and he'll he improves on every loss, and I feel like that's the mark of a of a really a good player. You know, yeah. what I mean, somebody who's on the road to being a top player. And you know, he so, takes the first round. Yeah, he took and he took the first round against Chris Sheik. Mm -hmm. Chris Cammy, and that's not that's no easy task. Yeah. So you know, yeah. good shit, Paul B. Interesting is Chris G has the space between Chris and G. Paul B smashes it together. Right? Yeah, yeah, yeah. It's You're Paul right. B. No, no break. That's pretty cool, I guess. There you go. Make the sweep safe. I don't know which one I like better. Ooh, wow, that was a big oh whip. Oh my up god! But Paul B You're flying all over the sadly, place. Sadly, he was not able. Uh, he wasn't really able to punish. Yeah, but, you know, it was. Luckily for Chris G, but sadly for okay. Paul. Okay. Ooh, nice. So his V-Trigger is about to Ooh. run out. He's probably going to get one more Rekka sequence. Uh, nice. I think he's just going to hold it. He doesn't really want to overextend here. Uh, oh, feed that was into a good job, Mini Punch. That was a chop. Nice. That's the game. Chris Shee takes the round. Not the game. The round. Yeah, he's around. Oh, Chris shaking it off. He's feeling mm -hmm. it. You know, interesting to note, Paul B is using the loner stick. Yeah. Yeah, you know, it, it's a little baby Kwanbok Q1. Valle was like, look, we need to get people these arcade sticks. You know what I mean? Like, we need to have at least some form of house stick yeah. for people. Uh, but I don't want people to come in here thinking they can just use my stick all day. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> so he gave them the little baby. Uh, Expenses might have been spared. Yeah. With these sticks, <laughs> yeah. the loner sticks. They're functional. For sure. For sure. Not now, uh, though. What's up? Not for that round. Nope. Yeah, he, uh, I don't know, man. I don't know about those loner sticks. They're a little suspicious, personally, in my opinion. Dude, they're okay. They're a little baby. They're made for little babies. They're, you know, definitely a lot lighter. Little, little baby hands. Little baby hand. Little, baby hand sticks? I mean, it's still a general sticks. layout, but. Little baby hands. Bro. You need that gentle touch. Yeah. <laughs> you, you, you know. You need the, the, that feminine. Yeah. The feminine you touch. Need a, you need a relaxed stick. hand. You need soft, velvety hands. Uh, I don't you're know, you're used to this. Korean sticks. Yeah, those things, you know, you need to manhandle those things. You want to get stuff out, man, you got to mash the shit out of them. Yeah, you, that's a workout, actual <laughs> yeah. workout. Those 15 yeah. reps. Yeah, every, every day. Yeah, every Both day. Both sides. Both sides. Uh, you know, you play sure play cross-handed just to make yep, sure you're getting S even. kill style, you know yeah. what I'm saying? Throwback shit. Oh, Ooh. there we go, Rekka's. Ooh. Ooh. Ooh, no. Ooh, he went for the, uh, the plus frame. The plus frame down one. Or down one. Down punch after the Rekka, but... Chris G smartly challenged it with a jab. Yeah, so uh, crouch jab will be all of Karen's options except the neutral punch ender. Yep. Or the back dash, which is the neutral kick. That is absolutely true. Yeah. So, I mean, from a risk reward perspective, it's usually about. Oh! Yeah, oh, wrecked. Yo, no goodness. chip kill really messed Paul B up right there. Oh, oh. Uh, yeah, Chris G, clutch comeback. That's kind of what he's known for. That's kind of his thing. Uh, especially in non-Marvel games. Uh, yeah. Because, you know, in Marvel... Marvel know, is made for it. Plus, he doesn't even play that style. No, he, he, he doesn't. control more Yeah, Morgan. exactly. Yeah. Ooh. Ooh. But Street Fighter, MKX, this dude's making comebacks all the time. Yeah. Waifu Wars. <laughs> I see you chicken little. Yes. Ooh. Battle of the Blondes. Ooh. Ooh, you see, he went for that, uh, he went for that counter hit. Oh, nice. 
Wow. Okay. Okay. So uh, it was That's just kind of a moment it. of silence. That was for Paul B's soul. Mm. Uh, it went into Chris G's hands. Now he's gonna take that home. Uh, flush down the toilet, probably. I don't. Chris G Chris doesn't G. seem like he's got a lot of. Fun. He's saying, he's "I got, got your soul. Fun. I don't want it." Yeah. yeah. Yo, That's what he's. 